Uh, okay. Are you excited Enjoy. for the reading? I, I, I guess. I don't know, am I? We're gonna be reading How the Grinch Stole Christmas. While my brother plays Fortnite like a trash 12 year old in the background. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking this about. Is, this is quality <laughs> streaming. This is quality streaming. My phone's at 20%, so we gotta make this quick. Plug it in. I can't. It's an iPhone. I don't have a charger and a headphone jack. Because, you know, Apple's retarded. All right. You know? Okay, How the Grinch Stole Christmas by Dr. Sis. Okay, you ready? Shh. Quiet. Dr. Susses. Okay. Every, shh. Every who... I'm going to kill you. Okay, okay. All right. Every who down in Whoville liked Christmas a lot. But the Grinch who lived in... Wait, who lived just north of Whoville did not. The Grinch hated Christmas, the whole Christmas season. Now please don't ask why. No one quite knows the reason. It could be his head wasn't screwed on just right. It could be his... It could be perhaps that his shoes were too tight. But I think that most likely the reason of all may be... May have been that his heart was two sizes too small, which is physically impossible. Okay, we already went over this. Don't. <laughs> yeah. Okay. But whatever the reason for his shoes, he stood uh, there on Christmas Eve, hating the Who's, staring down from his cave with a sour, grinchy frown at the warm, lighted windows below in their town, for he knew every Who down in Whoville beneath was busy now hanging a mistletoe. Wreath. What? And they're hanging their stockings. He snarled with a sneer. Tomorrow is Christmas. Is practically here. Then he growled with the Grinch fingers, nervously drumming. I must find some way to stop Christmas from coming. <laughs> For tomorrow, he knew. All the who, all the who girls and boys would wake bright and early. They'd rush for their toys, and then. Oh, the noise, the noise, the noise, noise, noise. That one thing he hated, the noise. Noise, noise, noise. Very noisy, apparently. <laughs> couldn't tell. Then the See, I couldn't young tell, actually. Can you, can you repeat that, please? Because I couldn't tell. Okay, okay. We'll repeat it, we'll repeat it. So this is the last page, so... <laughs> I'm ready to tell, please. <laughs> oh, the noise. The noise, noise, noise. That's one thing he hated. The noise, noise. When the who's young and would sit down at to wait, wait, would sit down to a feast, and they'd feast, and they'd feast, and they'd feast, 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 feast. They would feast on who pudding and rare who roast beef. Wait, rare who roast beast, which was something the Grinch could not stand in the least. What 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 does the Grinch like? Nothing. He's the Grinch. He tried to steal a holiday because you know. Oh okay. Because that's possible. And then they do something he liked least of all. Every Who down in Whoville, the tall and the small, would stand close together and Christmas bells ring. They'd stand hand in hand, and the Who's would start to sing. They'd sing, and they'd, sing, they'd sing, and they'd sing, and they'd sing. And the more the Grinch thought of this Who Christmas sing, the more the Grinch thought, I must stop this whole thing. Why, for 53 years I've put up with it now, I must stop this Christmas from coming. But how? Okay, this guy's a 53-year-old trying to stop a holiday, and his heart's two thousand too small. How is he not dead? That's, um... That's... Maybe he's just, uh, from today's day and age, he gets offended by everything. That's true. Maybe. Then he got an idea! An awful idea. The Grinch got a wonderful, awful idea. I know just what to do, the Grinch laughed in his throat. And he made a quick Santa Claus hat and coat. And then he chuckled and chuckled. With a great Grinchy trick, with this coat and this hat, I shall look like St. Nick. All I need is a reindeer. The Grinch looked around, but since reindeer are scarce, there was none to be found. That, 
Does that stop the Grinch? No, the Grinch simply said, if I can't find a reindeer, I will make one instead. So he, call, so he called his dog Max. Then he took some red thread and tied a big horn on the top of his head. Where did he get the horn? Um, Maybe he tied it off a reindeer. But if he found a reindeer, but then it, we wouldn't need to tie a horn to it, Max. Yeah. Gosh. Reindeer, See, don't, have, reindeer don't have horns. Wait, <laughs> wait, yeah, they do. They have antlers. <laughs> well, yeah, all right, you're right. <laughs> then he left right. some bags and some old empty sacks and uh, some ramshackle sleigh on a ramshackle sleigh and he hitched up old Max. The Grinch said, Giddy up! And then sled, sled it, wait. And the sleigh started down toward the homes of Pooh's lay a snoozed in their town. Did you just say a snoozed? Yeah, that's what it says. A snoozed in their town. Don't question me, I'm a professional. You're a professional? All their windows and the I'm a professional children's story book. Because we are now experts in the field. In field? In the field. Of what? Storybook reading? Yes. Okay. And their windows were dark. Quite snow filled the air. Quiet snow filled the air. All the who's were all dreaming sweet dreams without care. When he came to the first little house on the square, this is the this is stop one. The old granny Grinch, wait, the old Grinchy claws hissed, and he climbed on the roof, empty bag in a fist. And then he slid down the chimney, a rather tight pinch. But if Santa could do it, then so could the Grinch. Where is Santa right now? That's my question. He gave up on Whoville. <laughs> so he doesn't need to. No, the Grinch wasn't stealing Christmas. He was just doing Santa's job for him. He could have killed. Wait, what if the Grinch just killed Santa? Then he would never ever have to worry about it. Yeah. Um, the Grinch doesn't know okay. how to kill people. He got stuck only once for a moment or two. Then he stuck his head out of the fireplace, flew. Where the little who stockings all hung in a row, these stockings, he grinned, are the first things to go. And then he slithered and sunk, slunk with a smile most unpleasant around the whole room. And he sh took every present, pop guns and bicycles, roller skates, drums, checkerboards, tricycles, popcorn and plums. And he, wait, who wrapped a plum? Who wrapped popcorn? I mean, I guess you could get, like, the metal tin things for popcorn, which would make uh, sense, you know? Yeah, that would make but more sense. Who wraps Why do you, you don't plum? wrap a plum. You just give someone a plum. Yeah, you just hand it to them. That's like the same thing. Why would you wrap a puppy? And suffocate it or something. And then he what? stuffed them in bags, and the Grinch very nimbly stuffed all the bags up, one by one, up the chimney. And then he slunk to the icebox. He took the Who's Feast. He took the Who pudding, and he took the roast beast. He cleaned out the icebox as quis quick as a flash, while the Grinch even took their last can of Who hash. Is that like... And he's uh, is that weed? All, <laughs> no. Yes. And then he stuffed all the food up the chimney with glee. And now, grinned the Grinch, I will stuff up the tree. I like my Grinch voice? I think it's pretty good. It's pretty great, choice. actually. I feel like that's what he would sound like. He'd sound like he's a smoker, like he's raspy. Sounds like Benedict Cumberbatch. Yeah, it does, kind of. Except it really grabbed... does. Well, thank you. The Grinch grabbed the trees and he started to shove when he heard a small sound like a coo of a dove. Why does a person sound like a, a dove? He turned around fast and he saw a small who, little Cindy Lou who, who was no more than two. The Grinch had caught had been caught by a tiny who daughter who'd got out of her bed for a cold cup of water. He started That's not allowed. Getting getting things to, getting out of bed, going to get water is not allowed on Christmas. Well, shut up. She started at the Grinch and said, Santa Claus, why are you taking our Christmas tree? Why? That didn't rhyme. You rhymed why with why, you lazy bastard. <laughs> <laughs> he did. 
But you know the old Grinch was too smart and too slick. He thought up a lie. He thought it up quick. Why, my sweet little tot, the fake Santa Claus lied. There's a light on this tree that won't light on one side. So I'm taking it home to my workshop, my dear. I'll fix it up there and then bring it back here. And his fib fooled the child. Then he patted her head. He got her a drink and sent her to bed. What a nice guy. But like kind of a dick. Um, and when Cindy Lou Who went to bed with her cup of with her cup, he went to the chimney and stuffed up the tree up. The last thing he took was a log for the, for their fire. Then he went up the chimney himself, the old liar. On their walls left nothing but hooks and some wire. And the one speck of food that was left in the house was a crumb, even too small for a mouse. No then he did the same thing to the other Who's houses, leaving crumbs too small for the other Who mouses. What did you say, Logan? That's not possible. No crumb is too small for a mouse. Yeah, there is crumbs too small for mice. Shut up, you. Mm, you first. I'm reading oh. a story. It's a quarter past dawn, all the who's still a, still abed. All the who's still a snooze when he packed up his sled. Snooze? Pack it, <laughs> a snooze. It's a funny packed word. it up with their presents, the ribbons, the wrappings. The tags and the tinsel, the trimmings and the trappings. 300 feet up on the slide of Mount Crumpet, he rode his his low to the tip top to dump it. Poo, poo. Poo, poo, the who. He was Grinchy-lish humming. They'll find that out now that no Christmas is coming. They'll just wake up. I know they, what they'll do. Their mouths will hang open a minute or two. When the who's down in Hoover will all cry, boo. That's the noise, the grin, grinned the Grinch. It, I, that's, I simply must hear. So he paused, and the Grinch put up his hand to his ear. And he did not hear. He did hear a sound rising over the snow. It started low, then started to grow. But the sound wasn't sad. Why Why was the sound so merry? It couldn't be so, but it was merry, very. He started down at Whoville, the Grinch oh, was who he, Then he shook. Forest. Then he... Wait. Then he shook what he saw, a shocking surprise. Every who down in Whoville, the tall and the small, were singing without presents at all. He hadn't stopped Christmas from coming. It came. Somehow or other, it came just the same. Just like your mom. And Whoa. the Grinch... <laughs> that hey, escalated hey. quickly. You escalated quickly. See? Stop talking. I'm trying to read a story. And the Grinch with his Grinch feet ice cold in the snow stood puzzling and puzzling. How could it be so? It came without ribbons, it came without tags, it came without packages, boxes, or bags. And it came, and he came puzzled three hours till his puzzler was sto sore. Then the Grinch thought of something he hadn't before. Maybe Christmas, he thought, he thought, doesn't come from a store. Maybe Christmas, perhaps, is a little bit more. And then he, and then it happened. And then what happened? Well, the who in Whoville, they say, the Grinch's small heart grew three times that day, which is again would would, would kill him. Not possible. That would kill him. Yep. Cool. And the minute his heart did not feel quite so tight, he whizzed with throw the bright morning light, and he brought back the toys, the food for the feast, and he himself. The Grinch carved the roast beast. I thought he stole it. <laughs> he did, but he, I mean, he back. That's, that's what I just read. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. You're not paying attention to my story? Nope. <laughs> I thought it was a pretty good story. How many more? How much more time do we have to fill? I, I was just going to ask that. Can I that was like 30 it? minutes. Can I 
I thought that was a pretty good story. Story time. Right. I'll read it again. How the oh my god. Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. Welcome to the story oh. part of our album. No. Can you take it downstairs? Okay. Thank you. No, take it downstairs and read it downstairs. You excited for Christmas, Logan? I am. How about you? What do you hope? I'm pretty good. I pretty much got all I wanted done. I got a new phone and I got a car, so. Oh, yeah. So... I'm not going to get much. I'm just hoping for cash because I really want to get a laptop. Yeah. I want. Before Hawaii. Mm hmm. Dude, I'm, I want a laptop before Hawaii so we can play Stellaris. <laughs> Dude, that'd be great. We can't. I don't know if we got one. Wi Fi to play on the plane. Yeah, that's true. Or you could just do single player. But still, I love that game. Stellaris is so much fun. Stellaris is fun, but it's kind of complicated. I don't know how to play it very well. You'll get a lot better at it. Yeah, if I keep playing it. Because, like, I've been playing in this one save with Owen for a while now, and that's the only reason I know how to play. So, you know Spore? I, I've heard of it, but I've never actually, like, played it. Okay, well, it's a really fun game. And you, you know how it works, right? Like, you make a species, you customize it, whatever. Kinda, yeah. Yeah, so it's super, super fun, except for the space stage. But if the space stage was replaced with Stellaris, the game would be, like, one of my favorite games. Did you watch the, uh, the videos? Um, oh, yeah, of, yeah, yeah, uh, of the space whales and, like, the giant tentacle porn and stuff. Wow, yeah. Yeah, those. Yeah, I yeah, lost yeah. my entire navy. <laughs> I know, that was pretty it great. Was, it was hilarious. Dude, can you tame them? Um, can you, like, can you recruit them or something? I don't know. Or I wouldn't say recruit, but, like, can you, like, capture yeah. it and make, make it fight for I mean, like, Owen did somehow with the Eldrakes. Yeah, I guess. So how are you today? What are you hoping to get for Christmas, Lenny? I want RAM. Hey, dinner time! I have to be here to fill 45 minutes of commentary. <laughs> this is for my friend Owen. Owen, hurry up, get back here. I hope no one clicked off just because I was reading a story. If anyone Robert even watched it. Watch. There's three people watching it. Is it me, you? Uh, no, it's not. We had four people at one time. Nice. Um, yeah. Owen needs yeah. to hurry up. Two random people watching. Oh, wait, that means there's one other person just watching us. Did you like my story? Yeah. Like my story. Adeline approves. I can subscribe my story. Adeline did enjoy my story. Did you like my story, Adeline? Yeah. No? She says no. I'm dead inside. Did you like it or no? Okay, Logan, I have to go soon because my phone's gonna die. And I also have to eat. Uh, um. But I will be back when you, Zach, and Owen are all playing. I'll watch the stream and join in on Discord. Yeah, Zach said he'd get on later tonight. Yeah, I know. He's gonna text me. And I'll, pro I'll probably stay up as just as late as you guys. Just chilling. I might have to be quiet though because my brothers might be asleep. Because mm. they want to wake up really early for Christmas, but I don't really, I don't really care. But you know, yeah, so. Yeah. I've returned. We'll, we'll figure it out. Oh, oh, hey! Dude, hey. We, filled tw we filled the whole time, actually. Yeah, the I, I heard. Runner literally just had to leave. <laughs> yeah, I have to go. My phone's gonna die. You should listen to my story. I listened to parts of it, but I'll uh, I'll oh, wait, go were through. Were you listening to it while you? A, a, a little bit of it. That's great. Thanks, man. 